In this video, we will show you how to terminate fiber optic cable. Here are the 9 basic tools needed for fiber termination. We will need the fiber cable, visual fault locator, SC connector, fiber optic stripper, drop fiber stripper, fiber optic cleaver, adjustable fiber guide, alcohol, and wipes. First separate the wire of the messenger from the fiber cable. Strip the cable jacket using the drop fiber stripper. Insert the fiber cable to the stripper hole until the end of the guide. Then press the stripper until you hear the click sound and gently pull the fiber cable. This is what the fiber looks like. This is made of glass and it's covered with blue cladding. Put the cable in the adjustable fiber guide. We recommend when purchasing SC connectors, you buy the whole pack to get a free measurement guide like this one. It indicates that the total length of the exposed fiber should be 28 mm. Just slide the guide to 28 mm, and we are ready to remove the blue cladding. Carefully strip the fiber cladding using the fiber optic stripper. Start stripping as close as possible to the adjustable fiber guide. As you can see, there is remaining residue or the blue fiber cladding. Clean the fiber with alcohol soaked tissue. Try to bend it side by side and double check for some impurities. The next thing we need is the cleaver. Put the adjustable guide together with the fiber on the cleaver. Close the cleaver and then cleave. Open the cleaver. After cleaving, make sure to properly dispose of the cut fiber. Remove the adjustable guide and the fiber cable and close the cleaver. This is the SC connector. This is the tail, connector body, fixing bracket or lock, connector head or tip, and the protective cap. Separate the tail from the body by rotating the tail cap and insert the fiber cable in the tail hole. Insert the fiber in the connector body. The fiber should bend lightly. Push the fiber fixing bracket upwards to lock the fiber. Lock the tail and put on the protective cap. and snap. We are now ready to test our work. This is the visual fault locator. We should see the light pass through the other side.
The SC connectors can be reuse. We will show you how. Push down the connector to release the protective cap. Remove the protective cap. Rotate the tail and separate it from the body. Push down the fixing bracket to unlock the fiber cable and remove the SC connector. Rotate the tail back to the SC connector body. Put on the protective cap. And the SC connector can be reused. We will remove the other one. Push down the connector to release the protective cap. Remove the protective cap. Rotate the tail and separate it from the body. Push down the fixing bracket to unlock the fiber cable and remove the SC connector. Rotate the tail back to the SC connector body. Put on the protective cap. And the SC connector can be reused. Thank you for watching.